Oh, that ball's absolutely roped. Greg Vaughn, take another look. Just because you bunt dance me, you Yo, what is up, everybody? It's your boy, the RZA, the Jizza, j j j j j j jit unit, Jit Romney. And in today's video, we're gonna be playing our first ranked seasons game. And if you guys are excited as I am, please drop a like and subscribe. We are on the path to getting YouTube partner, and it would mean more than I could ever express. But before we get into the ranked seasons gameplay, I have to show you guys what I've been up to. So as you guys can see, we have been grinding. We finished the BR program. We also finished the AL East team affinity. Before we open up those packs, let me just show you guys what I've been doing for team affinity so the first thing i did for team affinity was i did all of the team's moments here comes the buzzing man but did the al east uh nl east all of these team moments after i did that i went ahead and did the showdown the showdown took me about an hour and a half for all of them it probably would take a little bit longer for you guys if you guys need hitting tips from a five-time top 50 player just hit the link in the top right corner next what you want to do is a conquest now i've done the east conquest and i've done the west conquest i got to do the al central conquest and while you're doing the conquest you want to do the captain stat missions as well as the henchman missions it's pretty annoying but that's like the best way to do it and after you do the conquest you want to go ahead and do the team affinity mini seasons i'm not done with it and the reason why i actually have ales done first is i did march to october and i don't really recommend doing the entire thing it took way too long it, it honestly took me like seven hours last night just to finish it but i really like some of those ales cards that's the only reason why i did it if you guys are trying to do the most effective way and get it out of the way first you just got to grind out mini seasons just play all of the home games just quit the away ones it's not too hard you don't even have to do these goals or anything like you'll if you don't do these goals it doesn't really matter it's just for xp and then once you get those mini season vouchers you can go ahead and come over to the team affinity and just put them in and five of them are 20k so that's probably the best way to do it i think that's how some of the people who've already completed all of team affinity have done it and that's what i'm gonna do to finish team affinity all right so now let's go ahead and open up some of these hacks so let's just start out with the al west honestly the al west is probably the weakest out of these so for our first team affinity player taken we're gonna go ahead and take jeremy pena now looking at his stats he's a pretty good player really 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 good fielder at shortstop has 99 speed however his swing really isn't that great and if you guys watch my road to the world baseball class you kind of know why but basically like he, he really can't turn on anything down and in and that's the pitch that you kind of have to hit in this game but he's not a he's not a terrible card and everybody's different next from the al west we're gonna go ahead and take eugenio suarez he's a pretty good card he might not really be too good on like hall of fame or legend but he has a ton of power and he's a decent fielder at third i just think there's better third baseman personally but if you guys are really really good with eugenio go ahead and take him once we start to get finished with the al west program I think next we're going to take Taylor Ward and then Adolis and then take Paul Blackburn last. He's just really not that good of a pitcher. And I've heard Adolis doesn't have a great swing and I'm not really too good with Taylor Ward. That's why I don't really value the AL West. But again, everybody's different. Next from the NL East, we're going to go ahead and take Acuna Jr. You could also go with Jorge Soler, even Joey. I just think the best first pick is going to be Acuna. We don't have the greatest outfield right now. He has 89 speed, 99 contact, 102 power. He's got a pretty good swing this year too. That's going to be my first pick. But if you guys don't really like Acuna cards, I think going with Soler or Joey first is perfectly fine. For the NL West, this is probably the most stacked division um i was thinking about taking either jock or soto first but the more and more i think about it i'm kind of starting to realize we really don't have the greatest pitching and i think dustin may is a very good pitcher in this game so we're gonna go ahead and take him if you guys don't want to take a pitcher first or already have a pretty good pitcher i think soto or jock should be your first picks and then after that just kind of go with whoever now we have five al east packs we're gonna go ahead and take everybody if you guys don't have the al east done i'll just tell you who i think the best players are and who you should take first you got to take rafi first there's just no doubt rafi's the best player in that pack after Rafi, I would go with a baby Bo Bichette. He is so good, man. I love his swing. He was so good for me last year. I cannot wait to use him. Third, you could either go with Giancarlo Stan or Cedric Mullins. I'm just going to go with Giancarlo. He just has a really good swing, and I was really, really good with him as well. Fourth, I'd go with Seti. He doesn't have the greatest stats this year, but I mean, his swing is so good. He's a really good outfielder. We might actually put him in there. I don't know. I got to see how the lineup's going to shape up. And for the last pick, I would go with Wander Franco. Not a terrible card. Uh, really good against lefties, but I just think there's four cards that are better than him, honestly. For our next pack, we're gonna open the br flawless program reward you get a pick of three players we're gonna probably take greg vaughn we need a left fielder i have been playing a lot of br on stream if you guys don't follow me twitch.tv slash jit underscore romney and br is just the best way to make stubs right now or just throughout the year if you go 12 and 0 that's like 400 500k I'm trying to avoid it, but I kind of got that non-sexual itch to play online games. So let's just go ahead and pick third leg Greg, man. There he is, Greg Vaughn. We're actually going to keep these cards as well. I'm not going to sell them. We're going to try to get set one done soon. Next, we're going to go ahead and open the season one charisma packs. In the first video I made for the series, I said our first pick was going to be Mad Bum, and that's who we're going to take today. Next pick, we're going to take Eric Davis. I've heard a lot of people have really, really liked this card, and I've liked him in past years. So let's go ahead and do it. Third pick, we're going to take Lee Smith. We actually really need a lot of bullpen help. I don't really think I have a decent bullpen at all. And from what I've been seeing, he's not too bad. 
And for our last pick, we're going to take Troy Glaus. He's most likely just going to be on the bench for a while. I don't plan on really using him. For the next pack, it's the Season 1 World Baseball Classic XP Reward. And th this is one of the harder packs because there's a lot of really, really good cards in here. I think the first pick we're going to make is Yoan. We really need a second baseman. For our next pick, we're going to go ahead and take Johnny Cueto. And our last pick is honestly the hardest one because I am so good with Freddie Freeman cards for whatever reason. And I really want to take him, but I think the smart pick is to just take Robinson Cano since we don't really have the most second base depth. And there's a lot of first baseman and third baseman in this game that I'm pretty good with. So let's go ahead and just take Robbie, man. This hurts though. I want to take it. I wanted to take Freddie so bad. I really did want to take Freddie. I mean, we can still go buy him though. Yo, why did my lights just go out? What the fuck? Bro, there's like spirits or something in here, man. Like uh, this recording might get cut out. You guys might never see this video and I'm just gonna be really upset. Our last choice pack is arguably the best pack in the game right now. So what I think we need right now is still another starting pitcher and a very good first baseman because we didn't take Freddie. So we're gonna go ahead and take Mirakami and Bob Gibson. There's Mirakami, arguably the best card in the game right now. And we're gonna take Bob Gibson. The reason why I'm not going Francisco is we have a pretty decent shortstop in Bo as well as Yohan Moncada at second. And I was thinking about Devin and I still kind of want to but I've just never been good at pitching with Devin William cards and I think Ricky Henderson has a terrible swing so yep Bob Gibson it is boys lock it in for our last pack opening we're going to be opening up 88 show packs hopefully we get Mike Trout and Shohei Otani we probably won't though we have terrible pack look 16 balling is a gold aka balling is a mid aka balling is a habit terrible pack one silver player we're just gonna oh, let's just open the silver right now man yeah mid um and then we have two diamond duos packs uh if we get Cattell Marte or Hugh Darvish I'm going to I'm going to make lose it, but I really doubt we get either of them. So uh, let's get to opening. Oh, and the uh, the way I've been getting these packs is by doing the Team Affinity Conquest. I started a little bit on the US map, so that's how I've gotten some of those packs. And I think maybe mini seasons and possibly the showdowns as well. I can't really remember, but the best way to get packs for free is Conquest always. Oh, and by the way, if you guys didn't know, the MLB The Show 23 Companion app is now available on iOS as well as Android, which is going to allow you to open packs on your phone and flip the market while you're at school or work or just wherever. And if you guys want the best method on how to make stubs right now, I should have a video link in the top right corner. If not, it'll be in the description. I mean, that's the most mid pack I've ever seen. That was like all commons. Oh my God. Give me something. Please just give me something. Even a gold at this point. Oh yeah, just troll me, man. Respect the tools, dude. Sick. By the way, SDS, we got to have a talk. There's a bat in this game. It's autism awareness. Why can't I sell it? I have autism, man. Like it, it's ridiculous. My rights matter. <laughs> All right, well, we just opened up like 88 packs or however many. Pulled zero diamonds, like probably like two golds, honestly. I, I don't even know. Time for the ball in as a habit, which probably going to get shit. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh, come on. I don't think it's good. I think it's decent, but I, I don't know. I don't know what's good and what's not. It's purple. It's, it's probably mid. Julio. Julio Rodriguez, welcome to the team. Even though we're probably going to sell you. Oh, that's 13K. Let's go, man. Let's go, Julio. All right, hey, never mind. Take back everything I said about you, Ramon. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look at the uh, the Mariners real quick and see if I'm gonna sell that card. And then we get George Springer. Uh, just sell him now. He's not going for that much normally. Then we get another supercharged. Yeah, just keep selling him. If you get supercharged players right now, man, just keep selling them. I mean, I know I could put in the buy order or, or the sell order and make some more, but it doesn't really matter. I dude, holy shit. I'm. Oh my god. I actually need Will Smith too. I mean, I'm getting the supercharged players. That's that's pretty cool. Uh, I, I might use like one or two supercharged players. I, I'm not too sure. Oh, we got another one. Dude, Ball is a habit is actually like uh, living up to its name today. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be, man? Come on, give me something good. I need a sh I need a Mike Trout or Shohei Otani. Oh, it's probably not them. Byron Buxton? Byron Buxton. All right, I'll take Byron. That's a good one too. I I'm trying to get the, uh, what is this? The AL Central done. I need that Joe Maurer too. He's probably going for a lot too. Ah, 15K is not too bad. I just got to check out those collections to see if it makes sense to sell them or not. Because if they're the only like expensive cards, I'm just going to keep them. Ballin' is a habit actually was really good. And that's like the first time I've ever said that in MLB The Show. Last two packs, Diamond Duos. Give me one of the good cards, dude. Nothing. Robbie Grossman absolutely launched a baseball yesterday, though. One more. Come on. Give it to me. Nothing. All right. Well, that's a pretty good pack opening, honestly. I didn't think we we're going to get shit out of the ball in his habits. We've opened up all the packs. Let's go create the most diabolical ranked seasons lineup. All right, boys. So as you can see, I think we created the best ranked lineup that we can possibly make right now. We're still going to be grinding. Don't you worry. Batting leadoff, we got Ronald Acuna Jr. Second, we got Rafi. Third, we got Giancarlo Sand. Fourth, Yohan. Fifth, third leg, Greg Vaughn. Mirakami. I got to learn how to say this guy's last name. Randy Rosarain is going to be in the seven hole. Eighth, we have supercharged Adley Rutschman. And ninth, we got baby Boat Bachette. On the bench, we have 
have Troy Glaus, Mookie Betts, Paul Goldschmidt, and Sedgwick Mullins. We're going to start our first game with Dustin May. Hopefully, we don't have to play two or three, but in that case, we'll go Madison Bumgarner, then Johnny. Our bullpen is very weak, especially lefties. I mean, when we're using two guys, I only use in BR. So I think we really need to get that uh, Taylor Rogers. I think. That's probably one of the best lefty relievers in the game right now. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and get into the gameplay. All right, let's see who we're playing. Let us see who we are playing. Hopefully, we don't get dashboarded. We're gonna be playing Jaspin 101, the, the Moner Boners. Oh man, this kid's gonna be one of them. He's actually got a pretty good team, uh, not gonna lie. Luis Garcia can kind of be hard to hit too. I don't really hit cutters too well. Jaspin uh, 101 is not fond of the A button. Hopefully he might've gotten dashboarded, honestly, at this point. It's been like, you know, it's been like a minute. Oh, I'm so early on that slider. Yeah, I'm gonna have to sit back. It was, this pitch speeds are a, a little slow, man. It's like I'm back in math. Rafi Devers. I grinded so hard to get you, Rafi. Come on, man. Rio to Rafi Devers. If it's down the middle, we're swinging. We swing 3-0 around here, man. We swing 3-0. Rafi! I'm nowhere near that baseball. I'm actually nowhere near that baseball. Oh my god. That's a 15 PTI, though. Honestly, it's gonna count as a run. Pretty embarrassing swing, honestly. I don't know how I'm missing that. Curveball's been fucking me up this year, but let's go. Rafi Devers is on the board. Stanton! Oh, I barely missed it, man. I barely missed that. Yo, on. That's gonna get in the gap. Is that gonna go though? Nah, that's gonna get down for a double. Extra base hit for Yoan Moncada. That away, kid. Dude, this is my this is my first time ever using Greg Vaughn. Uh, I've never used him, and it's his first year in the MLB uh, series. So, hopefully, he's got a good swing. I haven't even seen any gameplay with him. Get up the middle. I just missed it, man. He's throwing me a lot of sliders. Oh, he fought. Oh, he messed up. Oh, let's go. He doesn't have the meter lab. Uh, that should. Be, uh, that's gonna count as an error, isn't it? It's going to count as a base hit. Yeah, I earned that one for sure. Mirakami, perfect, perfect right to him. Ah, that sucks. That sucks. That's a pretty decent ending. Not the best swings, though, to be honest. Especially that Rafi one. That was just kind of fluky. It looks like this might be his first ring game, too. I didn't see his record. Uh, let's just start him off with a sinker in. Oh, that's a, the best pitch in the game, honestly. Uh, I, I think he's going to be chasing that sinker. So let's just probably throw him a slurve right here. I need you to just swing through it. Oh, this kid needs the hitting tips. He needs the hitting tips badly. That was actually a pretty decent swing. That's just baseball, though. Yeah, this kid really needs the hitting tips. That's a four-pitch inning from Dustin May. Vamo. Shit. At the way I'm hitting, though, I might need him as well. Randy Rosarena, Rutschman, and Baby Boba Shet. Come on, we got to get a run. Just get a run. You know, let's get something going. Got to boost our average, too. Randy, we worked pretty hard to get Randy, too, and he's not even the greatest card, but he's a pretty decent center fielder. Randy Rosarena, never mind. Perfect, perfect. Let's go. Bama. We got up Adley Rutschman, the Flying Dutchman. Adley Rutschman, the Flying Dutchman is just late on it. Oh man, that's embarrassing. Late on veteran. Ooh, mm. Bad look, Jit Romney. Baby Bo uh, Shet. Come on. This was, this was honestly like my favorite shortstop last year. PCI is just a melon up there, dude. He, he might auto pitch a fastball down the middle. <laughs> I think, he, yeah, he just auto pitched it. I'm late on it. Oh, man. That's just bad. I'm going to take it, though. That's a great swing from a great player. Oh, this kid's like not here. Yeah. All right. Well, that's, a, I mean, honestly, a home run is a home run, you know? <laughs> I'm late on an auto pitch down the middle. That's just embarrassing. Ronald Acuna Jr. This kid's not even playing. And I'm happy about perfect, perfect home runs. Let's just try to get the mercy. I mean, we, we picked Dustin May. Might as well get some innings out of him, too. So for our second game, we're going to be facing Luis Garcia again. The Philadelphia Chubbums are going to be playing O Park. And it looks like we're at a created stadium of some kind. Hopefully it's not max elevation. This kid ain't ready for it. He's 0-3. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Easy one. Oh, I'm striking out on veteran. Oh, no. That was definitely a strike. Ravi Devers. That away, kid. That away. Dude, he's just got the best swing in the game. That's that's why I wanted him so bad. He's got three home runs already. I mean, one of them doesn't count. The other one was a no touch. But that's his best swing so far. Big Giancarlo stands. Let's get into one here, kid. It's a great pitch. Honestly, I thought about swinging at that. A button. A button. A button. A button. There we go. Stay fair. Oh, Giancarlo. Oh, that's staying fair. Let's go. That away, kid. That away. I did not think that was going to stay fair. It's a great swing. I mean, I'm telling you, I got to sit back so long on this. I'm just used to like a little bit faster speeds, dude. Just a bit inside. Come on, Yohan. We got to keep the 1000s with him. Uh, and this kid's going to get to quitting, isn't he? Nice. All right. Well, we're 2-0. We're 2-0, baby. Love to see it. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. 
For our third game of the day, we are going to be playing Nestor Cortez, and it's the Los Angeles Honey Badgers, Sir Matty 20. We're definitely at a Major League Stadium, there's no doubt in my mind. Oh, we're playing at the, the Super Dungeon, man. Nice. The shadows here are great. This is a game you actually have to, like, kind of lock in. I know it's a little bit easier of a difficulty, but you got to, like, sit up. You got to play perfect because the stadium is just terrible. We got another person who just doesn't know where the A button is located on their controller, man. Like, dude, you guys, like, love watching these cutscenes, dude. You have a whole year of cutscenes. You can just skip it right now. Ah, man, on top of it. All right, Rafi versus a lefty. Uh, we, if it gets deep into this game and we need to, we're going to put in Troy Glouse, I think, or, or somebody else. Maybe not. Maybe not. Ah, I'm telling you, man, the stadium's just not that good. That's not the greatest swing, though. He's only thrown three pitches. We got to put the controller down right here. I mean, I don't care if you give me a 2-2 two -two strike count. Dude, I haven't... I, I mean, I legitimately... My hands are on the controller. It's 3-1. There you go. All right, let's sit up right here. Giancarlo. Come on, man. Don't give me some just early cheese. Oh, that's, dude, that sucks. That sucks. We gotta have better swings, though. We really do. This is my first time using Madison Bumgarner. Hopefully, he, he's actually good. A sweeping curveball. Oh, this might hang. It's a great pitch. I don't think you're gonna want to bunt dance me. I know I'm not hitting the best, but you're not gonna want to bunt dance me, brother. Baby bow. Baby bow. Baby bow. Let's go. Two down. Yep, there it is again, man. Honestly, this might just be like a little kid and he's like trying to fake me out with bunting. Just don't throw him strikes. There's, there's no reason to throw this kid strikes. Just, dude, like he's going to swing at this. Yep. All right, let's go. One, two, three. I mean, that's that's a great in from Mad Bum. This kid really doesn't have thumbs. I really just need them to not quit, dude. I feel like if I hit one home run or just something good happens, they're, they're always going to quit. It's kind of annoying. Yoan? Oh my God, man. That's a pretty good swing. That sucks. Third leg, Greg Vaughn doesn't even have a hit for us. I only think he has like one or two at bats though. That boy, three out of Greg Vaughn. Love to see it. Yeah, that way. We swing through all around here, man. It's right down the middle. Good swing. That's a really, really good swing. I like that. We got Mirakami, lefty, lefty. We need something going. Oh man. <laughs> I don't know why I'm swinging at that, bro. I really don't. That's just embarrassing. It's a good pitch, though. It's a really good pitch. Randy Arozarena against the lefty. We have to hit home run, dude. If we don't hit home run, man, I, I don't know what to say. Or that. I mean, I, I guess I can say that. He gets hit. Adley Rutschman, the flying Dutchman. Adley Rutschman, the flying Dutchman. That's going to score a run. Very good. We're going to third, too. Oh, this kid's kind of got a brain, though. Good. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. Adley Rutschman, the flying Dutchman, comes in with an RBI single. Very good. Now you got baby bow up, dude. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh my god man uh, do i have to up the dosage this year do i gotta like start like taking more adderall man like dude i could just throw i could throw this the the sweeping curveball in the dirt every single time he swing i think i might just start doing that until he starts taking yeah i mean we're gonna boost the madison bum gardener strikeouts today and another sweeping curveball until you take thank you very much <laughs> i'm just gonna keep throwing it until he takes it well, the, the first time he takes it i'll stop throwing it yeah, dude. I mean, I'm playing critters right now. What's more embarrassing, though, is that I only have two hits and one run. Very good. All right. He finally took it for once. Here's a fastball up and in. Thank you very much. Oh, my God. Ronald Acuna. That ball's got a family. And that... Oh, yeah. Never mind. Never mind, man. This game is just made... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? I guess he's going to go back to his family. I guess so, dude. Holy shit. Rafi Devers, come on. Don't You can't do it to me twice. You actually can't do it to me twice. There's just no way, man. Do perfect perfects back to back. Are you kidding me? Bro, this is why... Oh, my God, man. I guess 75 power, okay, but still, bro. Holy shit. All right, that one's not getting caught. Giancarlo Stanton. Let's go. That's three perfects in a row. Only have one run and one hit out of that. Just kind of ridiculous, but... It's a 15 PCI is getting down. He, he doesn't have thumbs. <sighs> I'm late on it, man. That's just so embarrassing. Back to the good old trusty uh, sweeping curveball. All right, he just took it. Uh, let's just give you a sinker, man. I'll take that. <laughs> that's how many six. Uh, that's six strikeouts for Madison Bumgarner. This kid really does need the hitting tips. I mean, hey, man. We all started from somewhere, though. We all started from somewhere, and I'm not even. I'm not even hitting that well, to, to be real. Uh, I can't be talking shit like this, uh, but I'm going to win this game for sure, though. It's like, swing the bat, bro. Actually, you don't want to swing at this one, but I know you will. <laughs> He's so early. Like, dude, I'm, I'm giving you fastballs early, man. It's just the power of Madison Bumgarner. Seven strikeouts through three. It's going to be a mad bum perfect game. 
Randy or Rosarena, you have like great defense. Why are you like jumping up there? I'll take it though. Oh, that ball's absolutely roped. Greg Vaughn, take another look. Just because you bunt danced me, you pussy. Look at this one. Look at this one. This ball's absolutely launched. Adios, Pelota. Yeah, I'm gonna give you some bunt dances now, man. Get through. Or just go right to him. Nice, nice. We, I, I feel like his players just have vacuums on their gloves right now. Randy! That away, kid. That away. That one almost got two. I would have been kind of, uh, or almost got caught too. I would have been pretty disappointed. Are we out at second? No, we're, we're good. We're good. We're good. Vamo. Vamo. Adley. That away, kid. That away, baby. That's going to score a run too. Very good. Very good. Let's just pull away. Let's get this game over with, to be honest. Sure, Maddie's just not having a good time. Baby Bo, don't you know? Baby Bo, don't you know? Ah, Baby Bo, they do know. Fuck. Ronald Acuna Jr. Oh, that ball's absolutely creamed. That ball's gone. Oh, let's go. I mixed my words right there together. Take another look. Take another look, sure, Maddie. I know you love watching, you cuckold. Rafi Devers, get through the hole. Yep. Oh my God, man. I waited for my pitch and I didn't. Oh, that's so bad. That's so bad. That's so bad. We should have ended the game right there. Man, all right. Oh, that was a good inning, though. That was a good inning. But again, that's why we don't play at these stadiums, really. Like, you know. I mean, I was going to play at Ship It. That, those, one of those are home runs at Ship It, at least. I'll take it out there. It's a great swing from Leland, though. He's going to be safe. He just stole a base on me. I don't care. Though. This kid just bunted with two strikes. Like, what? What the? What is going on? Like, the game's lagging. I almost. I. I, I think one of us almost got disconnected. Somehow we're, we're still in this game. Thanks for the free out, man. Appreciate that, brother. That was almost the best three-one circle change I've seen in this game. But we'll take a walk. We got a third leg, Greg Vaughn, man. He's two for two, a home run and single. Let's try to get a. Let's try to get the cycle with him. Nope, we're just gonna get another home run. That ball is absolutely launched. Is it staying in the ballpark? Yo, dude, like what? Actually, though, like what is this, man? That's <laughs> like what the fuck is this game? Like, dog, that's 114 power on a fastball down the middle. I'm not trying to shit on this game, but that's actually just so frustrating. Like, I understand perfects can't always be hits. Like, what am I supposed to do there, dude? Like, I, that's legitimately the best swing in the game, and it's just gonna not go for a home run or even a hit. It's just baseball. That's just baseball, though. Randy Arozarena. That's gotta go. That's gotta go. Vamo. Vamo. Players weren't even running, man. Nine to nothing in the fifth. Let's just get the mercy roll. This is running up on him. Get through. Get through. Get through. Super dive. And he, dude, he's got the meter down, too. I respect that. Baby Bo. Baby Bo, don't you know? Very early. We're gonna get two. Ronald Lacuna Jr. Mm, is he gonna be safe? He's gonna be. Oh, okay. We're safe everywhere. Safe everywhere. Rafi. That's gotta get down. That's getting down. Go three. Go three. Nah, say two. Say two. Say two. Yeah, we're safe. Okay, let's go. That away, Rafi. All right, we got the mercy rule in effect now. But first, Giancarlo's gotta hit a bomb. Giancarlo's too early. Oh, no. That's a strike. I'll take it, though. Giancarlo is gonna line out. Yep. That, I mean, that's why we don't play at these stadiums. I'm gonna be real with you boys. Like, I know I'm kind of complaining about it. It's veteran and I'm beating them 10 to nothing in the fifth, but just don't play at these stadiums, man. Like, just don't. Mercy rule is in effect. I'm just gonna throw the sweeping curveball until he takes it. Might honestly, like, intentionally walk somebody to, like, slide step to get this game over with. Oh, he took it. And the one, two sweeping curveball. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Nine strikeouts for Madison Bumgarner, five innings. That's an MLB the show record. Nice, man. We're going to bunt. Bunting actually might be back this year, low-key. It, it could actually be kind of viable. I, I've seen some people get bunt hits and, like, stealing bases as well is kind of back. And the 0-2 sweeping curveball. So ain't going to miss. Struck him out. Let's go. Good game. Not really, though. You suck at this game. All right, boys. I think that's enough rank today. Before this video ends, let's just go ahead and recap what we talked about today for the No Money Spend series and what you guys should be doing. So first, I showed you guys how to do team affinity and the best methods for it, which are doing all of the missions, showdowns, conquests, and mini seasons. If you guys really don't like doing conquests, so you could probably skip it and just do mini seasons. I, however, think it's necessary to get it done and also get some of the other missions out of the way. And after that, I showed you guys what players I think you should take for the team affinity packs. Next episode, I think we're going to start working on on collections and trying to get Derek Jeter, Sammy Sosa, and Mark McGuire. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys have not already, please drop a like, subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications, and have a good rest of your day, boys.